When we walk with the Lord in the light of His Word, what a glory He sheds on our way. While we do His good will, He abides with us still, and with all who will trust and obey. Beloved, as we are entering our third week of Lent, I would like to encourage you with Psalm 63 verses 1 and 2. O oh God, you are my God. Early will I seek you. My soul thirsts for you. My flesh longs for you in a dry and thirsty land where there is no water. So I have looked for you in the sanctuary to see your power and your glory. We do like King David, face situations which seem hopeless, scary, or very rough. When the desert situation we face seem to scorch and burn us, leaving us so burdened, weary, dry, confused, thirsting for relief, for peace, for solace, let us like King David, seek him early, declaring that he and he alone is our God, whom we praise and honor, no matter what our situation might be. Whenever all hope, all trust, all belief seem to fall apart, trust God, praise and glorify him until you feel his living water flowing over your soul. Know and believe with all your power, with all your might, your strength, that he alone is worthy to set you free from any situation you have no control over. But he is worthy. Hasn't he proven to come true in most difficult situations. If you let go and let God, he will never leave you nor forsake you. Let this Lenten season be one like never before and give him all the glory and honor and your all. Father, we thank you for who you are, that in our most difficult situations, you prove to cover us under your blood and keep us safe through every challenge. Thank you for showing us the way you dealt with your desert situation. Help us to run to you, to run the race before us with you to receive the prize of eternal life. No matter what may come our way, with you in the vessel, Lord, we are safe in any storm. We thank you in Jesus' name. Amen. Trust and obey, for there's no other way to be happy in Jesus, but to trust.